Good luck to you, sir. And you, sir. I do hope you have a good game, miss. And you, sir. Why the hell are you talking like that? Well, this is an important part of the process, Frank. Gives the illusion of respect for your opponent. Things are about to get real dark real quick, Frank. It's nice to start off on a positive note. Oh, that reminds me. Once the game officially begins, you are not allowed to ask any questions. Yes! In fact, if you do, don't say a question. Look it up in the book of rules, okay? Jesus Christ. Oh, I think I understand. No, you haven't begun to understand, Frank, but that's okay. You'll get it as we go along, like every other board game. D, how much time? Uh, 10 seconds. Ah, perfect, okay. Gentlemen, suck my dick. <laughs> Inconspicuous. Your entire mouth is stained red, Frank. It is. Oh, yeah. we're gonna be at the barbecue soon. Yeah, I'm pre-gaming, man. What was going on with you, man? You're going off the deep end lately. I feel like he's been waiting around in the deep end for a while no, now, bro. Charlie. It's different. He's staying out like all hours of the night. I never see him. If he is around, he's usually not even wearing clothes. <laughs> I'm wearing clothes now, bitch. You're wearing a shirt that's on inside out and it's covered in grease. Yeah, you're really greasy. It's not grease. It's sap. Sap? How did you get covered in sap? I got really wasted. I must have climbed a tree. Really stepping up the inside. Sanity, yeah, huh? I'm trying to push myself. I want to see how far I can go. Yeah, I feel like you've been standing on the edge of a cliff for a while now. I say hop off. Let's see where you land. I really wish you wouldn't encourage him, man. I really wish you wouldn't. Charlie, if somebody wants to it. push his boundaries, you got to let him. Frank, jump. I never felt more alive in my life. Oh, I'm sure. I'm There's sure. a street right there. Oh, what the hell? I thought we were going to a barbecue, Frank. It's more of a party in the park. We're at a cemetery. The party is in the cemetery. Who has a party in the cemetery? Your Uncle Max. He just croaked. Flush that turd down the drain. <laughs> mm. Well, I don't know how many years on this earth I got left. I'm going to get real weird with it. Meanwhile, block the wind. I'm going to roast this bone. Jesus Christ. Come on. Sorry. Would you rather I had them aborted? Children, would you like to have been aborted? I can't believe this. I just can't believe this. Hey, Dad, keep your you whore. Down. Keep it down. Keep, keep it, it down. down. Don't, Don't down. make a scene. Oh, no, I'm not going to make a scene. I was just told, excuse me, that my horrible whore wife has tricked me into raising two bastards for 30 years, and I'm being asked to not make a scene. Oh, oh, excuse me. Oh, did you bang my wife? Huh? Did you bang my whore wife? Does anybody here have any illegitimate children with my whore wife that I should know about? Jesus, Frank. Jesus, Jesus, Frank. 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 My life is a lie. My life is a lie. Somebody's got to get stabbed. Somebody's got to get stabbed. <laughs> Stop! Okay, why well, don't you get in front of the flag and the million dollar bill there? Dude, you and my dad share this futon? No. No, we. No, we got a whole different situation worked out. What's the situation? It's. I sleep on the. And. You got the script that I wrote? Grab the script. I've been meaning to speak to you about this. I can't read these words. They're not in the right order. It's good. I think you might be dyslexic, bro. I'm not reading this. I'm gonna... No, 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 no please. Read I think it. you might be dyslexic. Just read the script once. OK, you want me to read the script? Yes. All right. And action. I'll read the words you wrote. Hello, fellow American. This you should vote me. I leave power. Good. Thank you. Thank you. If you vote me, I'm hot. What? Taxes. They'll be lower. Son, the Democratic vote for me is right thing to do, Philadelphia. So do. This doesn't make any sense. Penis? No, it's a, a bicep. Bro, oh, I just had the most perfect blonde guy slip right through my fingers. I mean, I had him in the palm of my hand and then 
he was gone, you know what I mean? I mean, this guy would have been perfect for you. What's up with this beefcake? Is he coming to the party or what? Big time. Great. Nah, he didn't read the flyer. No, oh, I read the flyer. He didn't understand. I understood it perfectly. Oh, okay. Okay, we need to take a second look at this flyer. Uh, yeah, right dude. There. What? Guys, check out who I just met buying a crossbow. This dude is the shit. I shall use this crossbow to pierce my broken heart. Yeah. All right, dude. Dude, isn't that guy awesome or what? He's like a poet. That guy's not awesome. No. Dude, do you know how hard it is to find a passionate guy like that these days? They don't make him anymore. You should have seen how passionate he got when I showed him the dick flyer. You, you knew? knew that it was a dick? Well, yeah, I thought we changed it. I, th I thought you guys were changing it. He was always, it was always meant to it be a bicep. a bicep. Well, then why did you cut it like, because it looks totally like a dick. I thought, like, all right, let's go with the dick thing. It's more masculine anyway. <sighs> I mean, shit, boy. if you want it to be a bicep, it needs more veins. <laughs> Cut, cut, cut. What? what the hell are you doing, dude? That's what those tapes sound like. Why don't you read the script that I wrote? I'm not reading the script you wrote, it's in English. It's riddled with spelling errors. Well, you know what I'm trying to write, just say it. I'm just gonna mumble some guttural sounds. Let's do another one. He's not gonna know what you're saying. Well, then we'll do subtitles or something. So how am I, I gonna feel like I should have something in Bro, my hands? You don't need anything in your hands. Like a weapon, a machete, or a machine gun a... or something. Okay, why don't you head down to the Wawa and pick up a machine gun? Well, read the script. You're not gonna read the script. Read the... Who's the director here? I don't care, I'm not reading the script. Right, fine, action! Bro, can I get my towel over my face again? Oh, yeah, put your towel on your face. All right, here we go. Action! Lift, I need my head I need a weapon. 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 Can we, you think we can make this look more like a cave? Promise that you would not bring up yeah. the helicopter, Dude, it's, Charlie. You're not the boss of me, all right? So well, what? technically, Charlie, I am the boss of you what? because I own half your shares. It's when? You sold me half your shares of the bar for goods and services. Well, wait, wait, wait a second. You've definitely given me half your shares too, dude. Well, maybe I gave you guys a couple shares when my back was against the wall and needed a little breathing room. Bro, you gave me a shitload of shares one time for a half a sandwich. What are you guys doing? Is this a hose job where you're hosing me down? Dude, you hose yourself down. You hose yourself oh, up no, and down, I Charlie. Down. Just Come on, what do you want me to do? I don't care. Yeah, get a job. Oh, get a job? Yeah. Just get a job? Why don't I strap on my job helmet and squeeze down into a job cannon and fire off into job land where jobs grow on jobbies? Now we're wasting time. We yeah. can just get out of here. You want me to walk? <laughs> hey, Frank, here's another idea. Oh, 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 where'd you come from? I've been walking next to you the entire time. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm a little uh, lit. And uh, I've been going over this. Thing. I'm trying to figure out how, how to, to bang on. Donna. I know, you've been talking about it for the last five miles. You know what, dude, it doesn't matter. I got a better idea. I think you should bang Gail the Snail. <sighs> My niece? Yeah. Gail the Snail? Yeah, dude, what's more depraved than that, huh? Plus, you're not blood-related, so it's not that weird. Uh, that is a good idea. I like the way you're thinking. Yeah. <sighs> uh, what's in it for you? Huh? Uh, uh, uh. Jesus. What's in it for you? Don't worry about what's in it for me, dude. Good <laughs> God, you are disgusting. A disgusting animal. Blinking <laughs> lights. Those are traffic signals. Okay. All right, wait a minute. I haven't gotten there yet. And great. You should be making a left turn here. There's no left. You don't know where I am, tape. This ain't working, Charlie. This ain't working. You should pass three the fuzzy poles and wait. blinking lights. Those are traffic signals. I passed the traffic signals. You should pass three fuzzy poles. They're stuck, Charlie. I need you here. This tape isn't working. This is KPFN Public Radio. Today on Do It Yourself Gardening, composting. I'm sure many of you are wondering what composting involves. You should pass three fuzzy poles with blinking <laughs> lights. Get the blinking lights and pull them and blink them. Light. Make sure your compost pile gets plenty of air. Now, I'm you're Sandra. Dumb bitch. Peel this apple for me, please? No! No, I'm not gonna peel an apple for you! But Mac always does it for me. Why does Mac peel your apples for you? He doesn't like for me to eat the apples with the skin on it. He says the skin's loaded with toxins. Okay, well, good news. Mac's not here. Well, I know he's not here, and that's why I need you to do it for me. Please, please. Oh, Jesus. Just eat it with the skin I on it. I do not like it with the skin, Dee. I'm not allowed to eat it with the skin. I'm not allowed! Oh, my God. All right. 
If you just shut up, I will peel the apple for you the way that Mac likes you to eat it. Give it to me. Give it to me! I'll do it the way that Mac insists. Okay? Yeah. You can do it, Dennis, because you're a winner. You haven't peaked. You haven't even begun to peak, but you're gonna peak today. Oh, you're gonna peak all over everybody. Make it work, Dennis. Work. Oh, that felt good. Was that sexy? That's that felt great. sexy. We'll, we'll Photoshop it. Yeah, I can see where this is going. Yeah, let's we'll just, just not do that right now. Let's let's you let's take another one. No, nah. no, nah, nah, we'll, nah. we'll find another picture that we can use, and nah. that'll be fine. Yeah. Let's talk about your likes and dislikes. Um, how about your favorite food? What would that be? Oh, milk steak. Hmm. Mm -hmm. What? Milk steak. I'm not putting milk just steak. Put steak. Just I'm gonna put steak. steak and then Don't that put steak. Put milk steak. She'll, She'll know what it is. No, she won't know what it is, She'll Charlie. Nobody knows what, what that is. No. Nope. Okay. All right. What's your favorite hobby? Uh, magnets. Magnets. Okay. Magnets. What? Like making magnets, collecting magnets, playing Get, with magnets. Just magnets. Oh, I'm gonna God. put snowboarding. We'll put snowboarding. I don't really snowboard. All right. What are some of your likes? Uh, ghouls. Son of a bitch. What are you talking about yeah, now? Funny little green ghouls. Go what? Like in movies and cartoons? What? Little what? green ghouls, buddy. Don't write ghouls. I'm not. I'm putting yeah. travel. Jesus Christ! What are your dislikes? People's knees. Oh come on, Bro, dude! Come you gotta on! Be you know what? We'll just make it all up. We'll make the whole we'll, thing up. We'll dock it. The picture. We'll make it up. Yeah, we're not even gonna cover, use you for this. Cover your knees up. <laughs> I, I was r running. Okay, because you're you're bleeding. Oh shit! Is it bleeding again? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm, these are hornets things, you know. I run into like like a lot of like hornets in my line of work, and I get stung up like bad all over my face and stuff, and then you know it starts bleeding. <laughs> oh, sounds interesting. Yeah. What, what is it that you do again? I work, I'm like a janitor. I, um, I'm a full-on rapist, you know. Um, Africans, dyslexics, children, that sort of thing. Uh, now, I'm gonna want the milk steak boiled over hard ah. and a side of your finest jelly beans raw. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Kelly, you have the most wonderful sense of humor. Hey, I own this joint and I know this guy and he is loaded. Mr. Kelly, we have your milk boiling just the way you like it back there for you, your steak. You're gonna like this. How's about I clear out the coat room and you guys hit it in there while the steak is getting ready? What? What in the hell are you doing? I got this. He's gonna be a great Charlie, this. make a move, Maul. No, no, don't. Oh my God! Oh, no. Ah! What I'm you leaving. Doing? You're grabbing her breasts? What are you doing? I don't know. What does make a move mean? It, it doesn't mean doesn't... stab at her breasts with your fingers. Oh, Come on, man. bro, you're ordering milk steak and jelly. The whole, across the street, too. Across the whole street. Yeah. Is there a man on that couch? <laughs> what are you saying? A man in a couch? <laughs> Hello. <laughs> That's absurd. Now, I believe there's a man in that couch right there. There is no man. There's no man. Say some things about Frank Reynolds. Say them loud and make sure that they're horrible, horrible things. Yeah. And then we'll deal with the man in the couch. Yeah. Okay, so there is a man in the couch. All right, just call Frank Reynolds an asshole. Who is Frank Reynolds? He's the man in the couch. Oh, my God. What are you people doing? Well, you just no. say something about Frank that's horrible. Call him an asshole. Frank Reynolds is an asshole. Oh, oh, thank you. Oh, my God. Oh, 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 oh great. Now you... Oh, 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 Jesus Christ. Oh, can't breathe. Yeah, do I? Make it, Frank. Let's do it. Let it couch. Okay, but did you hear she called uh, you an asshole? She called you an asshole, yeah, yeah. Frank. No, yeah. No, yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh. What up? Are you ready for the best idea ever? Do you have money? Do you want even more money? Well, guess what? We've got a great idea for you. I, no, I told you not to stay. stay out of my peripheral through the hole. Two, one, fight milk! The first alcoholic, dairy-based protein drink for bodyguards! Bye, bodyguards! I drink it every morning so I can fight like a crowd! Ah! Let's get out of the way. There we go. It's, it's all about the product shot. What do I stand? Uh, don't do the hole. I want them to see the whole thing. Fight milk! Ah! Rose! Ah! Milk! Made fresh by bodyguards and Charlie. What up? We're Watch his profit soar high as a crow. Ah! Ah! 
Watch your profits soar high as a crow! Oh, sorry. Wait, <laughs> you dabbing out? <laughs> I knew you would be. All right, let me get the bucket. Let me get the bucket. Okay. Darkness falls. And magic stirs. Oh, it's stirring, it's stirring. As we become the creatures of the night. Jesus Christ, Frank, are you cutting your toenails with a steak knife? Yeah, I suppose you have a problem with that, too. Ah, oh, oh, botched toe. I botched that one. Oh, that's a botched job. Oh. That's bleeding. I need some trash to plug up the cut. Do not plug an open wound with trash. Uh, oh, it's bleeding like a sieve. They forth, but I think more often than not, bears are tops, uh, unless they happen to be power bottoms. What's a power bottom? Right? A power bottom is a bottom that is capable of receiving an enormous amount of power. Actually, Mac, you got it backwards. You see, a power bottom's actually generating all the power by doing most of the work. Does the power have to do with the size or the strength of the bottom? Now, Dennis, I've heard that speed has something to do with it. Speed has everything to do with it. You see, the speed of the bottom informs the top how much pressure he's supposed to apply. Speed's the name of the game. Right, buddy? God damn it. Are you taking the car with you on these trips? Me? Oh, no. No, no, no. I'm, I'm looking for something for my daughter. Your daughter? Yeah. You know, safe, slow vehicle. Good starter car. A starter car. That's right. I have contained my rage for as long as possible, but I shall unleash my fury upon you like the crashing of a thousand waves! Be gone, vile man! Be gone from me! A starter car! This car is a finisher car! A transporter of gods! The golden god! I am untethered and my rage knows no bounds! Ideas. Yeah, don't waste your time. I know what the billboard's gonna look like already. Two gorgeous girls up there, giant cans, me in the middle with my thumbs up. <sighs> well, that's just simply not gonna happen. Uh, actually, maybe Frank has a point, dude. Maybe we should put a dude up there. Certainly not him. But if we put some hot beefcake up there, maybe it'll attract more chicks. Yeah, that's a good point. Okay, I like that. Well, you know, let's slap my picture up there. It's about time I got my modeling career off the ground anyway. <laughs> don't flatter yourself. You're not gonna be up there because I am gonna be the face of Patty's bar. That's ridiculous, Frank. You're, um, ugly. And what? Ugly. I'm ugly. Yeah? With that anteater nose, you're telling me I'm ugly? My nose was chiseled by the gods themselves, Frank. My body was sculpted to the proportions of Michelangelo's David. You, on the other hand, well, you're a pit of despair. Frank, you disgust me. You disgust everyone, and you will never, ever be on that billboard. It's the chair. You don't think it's the chair? Well, maybe my old pal, uh, Abraham Lincoln begs to differ. Oh, okay. You, uh, you can just hand it to me. Please. Hello. Your waiter. Great. Hi. Can you get him a new chair, please? Sure. Oh, okay. oh uh, maybe this George Washington will make it come here faster. Okay. This wine is for you. Ah, management sent us a bottle to accommodate us. Actually, it was your friends over at the other table. And they wanted me to relate to you that it's our most expensive bottle. They said to say that. That's a classy move. I'm going to stand up and bow. No, do not stand and bow. Let me think. We've got, we've got to do something in return. Okay. Tell you what. We'll send it back. We'll say, I don't want that. You know, we'll tell them that uh, the Chilean wine is out of season and that their taste in wine in general is very poor. No, that's, we've got to be more subtle than that. I don't want them to know that we're thinking about them. What are you doing? What are you doing? Are you staring at them? Yeah, dude, Charlie's looking right at me. Stop it. Dude, stop it. You stop looking and stop. All right, you know, God damn it, I'm just going to pour the wine out. I believe I'm coming down a bit of something here. <clears throat> I got bit by a crab under that same bridge. Oh, did you? Yes. You ever been oh, bit by oh. a crab, hun? Can we maybe put this divider up? Well, no. We don't want to exclude a great man like Frank from the conversation. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God! Go 911! <laughs> no, it's okay! I have attention consumption! Hey, he's all right. <laughs> Why don't we drop him off? You and I will go to dinner, okay? Go on! <laughs> Stick!
Oh my God. Can I offer you a nice egg in this trying time? Yeah, he's got an egg. You might. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm there. I pull over. Okay. <laughs> you two can go to dinner together. Help me, somebody, please. Ah, shit, Charlie. What the hell went on back there? <laughs> Ah, I swallowed like a million blood capsules because I was going to cough like, you know, a handful of blood to make it real. And now I'm thinking like you're not supposed to eat them or something because they're making me really sick. Oh, Merge, Merge, you had your, come on, you got, you got to seize the goddamn gap. People are so goddamn inefficient. Oh, goddamn it! I don't care if you're old, seize the gap! You old fat bitch! Now don't merge, don't merge, we're all, we'll all wait. We'll all wait for you to send your text. You fat pig! How you doing, neighbor? Does that make me crazy? Shut up! Does that make me crazy? Does that make me crazy? Not letting you in, pig! I'm gonna show up to work and everybody be like, why is there blood all over you? Because I had to slip the guy's throat who causes all the traffic! Come on, Boy, it sure is a hot one, huh? Shut up. I hate the flippers. What are we watching here? What do you do about cats? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cats, cats. Is that me? Cats. I'll tell you what to do with cats. Who shot this thing, Dennis? Here's what you do with cats. Back in the sweatshop at Nam, we found a cat. We toss it right in the soup. Those hungry bastards eat cat soup every day. What's the worst thing that could happen? Some little kid choke on a hairball and die. So then you toss him in the soup. I was making money hand over foot. Literally. Somebody lost a hand or a foot. I toss it in the soup. <laughs> well, that's all a lie. I, there was no soup. No. There's no sweatshop. Excuse me, I gotta go to the can. How could you do this to me? Okay, Charlie, we don't want them in the bar either, okay? But freedom has a price. The McPoyles are probably gonna stab me, and freedom has its price? I can't believe you guys! You know what? Let me kick down a little thing to you that our founding fathers kicked down to me. It goes, don't tread on me. And right now, you guys are treading all over me! D, let's roll. Mm, I don't wanna go with you. What? Mm-mm. -mm. No, come on. You, you're my actor. I need you. I know, but you're so bad at protesting. Come on, D. You're my actor. I don't want to go. Come on. You, now you're treading I'm on me. I'm not treading on you. Yeah, you are. You're treading on me. No, I just and don't you're not go. supposed to. I don't want to go. Are you go. kidding me? No. Is everyone going to tread on me? Oh, my God. Okay. Okay, I'm going to rise up. I'm going to kick a little ass. going to kick some ass in the USA. going to climb a mountain. going to sew a flag. going to fly on an eagle. I'm going to kick some butt. I'm going to drive a big truck. I'm going to rule this world. I'm going to kick some ass. I'm going to rise up. I'm going to kick a little ass. Rock, flag, and eagle. Yeah. Well, yeah, you know, uh, Grant? Yes, Grant. I want to I wanna change my answer. What? 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 Well, I realize it's, it's not totally accurate because I've seen a pig eat a man. In fact, I've seen many pigs eat many men. It was a bloodbath. Yeah, well, Andrew, help me out. Name an animal that we eat but doesn't eat us. Well, Grant, I tell you what, mm -hmm. I like to eat cock. I'm so, whoa, no, 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 no. Oh, a little bit of background. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, actually, just for, for clarification, um, he raised them, but he didn't sire them. Now, he may have sired him, we're not exactly sure, but they do live together in squalor. Yeah, yeah. I actually brought my blood bucket in case you guys want to run his blood and see if it all checks out. It'd be good to know. Yeah, if we want to do like a quick DNA sequencing yeah, yeah. at the commercial break, that actually would clear we things could, up for everybody who set the record straight. But either way, I was always the odd man out, you know? I mean, you know. And Charlie? Yeah? Just need you to name an animal. Yeah. That we eat but doesn't eat us. Doesn't eat us, that's yeah. easy. A dragon! <laughs> Charlie, do you eat dragon? No, I don't eat dragon because uh, it's, it's not a meal for peasants, it's a meal for kings, and I'm sort of a common man. But they don't eat us. They, it's a, a misconception. They actually eat gold and treasure. That's why they're always sitting on a big pile of it. Bad answer. Bad answer. Bad answer. Bad answer. Bad answer. It's, it's a bad answer. Okay, bad show answer. me dragon! Ah! Dennis wants some gum. All right, hang on. Look, don't do that. 
What? That's a power play, Charlie. It is? Yeah. How's the power play? It's a power play. Everybody knows that the head cow is always grazing. Well, that's what? true. So that's like a real thing? Yeah. Makes sense. If you're top cow, what are you going to not eat? Yeah, I'm sorry. We can't help you. Uh, all right. Well, I have info. All right. Well, what's your info? First, give me some gum for Dennis. Oh, hardball, huh? Okay, I'll tell you what. Mm, don't, don't, don't. I'm going to give you one shred. in front of Frank. I, I want to be a big deal cow, too. Well, now I want to be a big deal cow, and I want gum. Well, but don't eat all my gum, Charlie. Uh, all right, well, what's your info? What'd you find out? What I found a clue. What is it? Give me some more gum for Dennis. No, I don't trust you. Hmm. Why not? Because you're just going to put it in your mouth and eat it again. I won't, I promise. Mm. His neck is high. Makes me trust him. Good posture, bro. Okay. Uh -huh. All right, I trust you. Oh! I knew oh, he couldn't be trusted. not cool, man. You can never trust another yeah. man in negotiation. That's just Art of the deal. Art of the deal, bro. All right, you try to tell me now. All right. See, this is exactly what I'm talking about. This is perfect. <laughs> I'm gonna break the ice. Go for it. I'm about to bust that shit up, Reese. I'm about to bust that shit up, boy. Absolutely. Okay, that didn't go on top of the way that I know. All right, maybe just one game. This is bullshit. Absolutely. It's very European. You see, Europe leads the way in sexual exploration, and quite frankly, I think it's time we caught up. This sounds hot. I'm gonna go get some duct tape. Oh, now, hold on a second there, Frank. Before you go sticking anything through that hole, you might want to consider that on the other side of this wall, more often than not, there's a dude. But you can't see through the wall. So how do you know it's not a girl? I mean, I could just picture a girl and then it's good. Yeah. Right, well, some might find that method effective, but it's a dangerous game you're playing, Frank. Supposing the other guy is picturing a girl also. How's he gonna do that with a dick in his mouth? I don't know, that's his problem. I'll allow you to watch. Okay, Frank, I... Oh, somebody's coming. Any minute now, the German broad is going to knock on that wall, which is my signal to go in my pants, take out my penis, and stick it through the hole. <laughs> then she can go to town. Hey, honey, you want to take care of this monster for me or what? There is no way I can picture that as a girl. Frank, Frank what the hell are you doing, man? Hey, that's my character. I'm the trash man. I come out. I throw trash all over the all over the ring, and then I start eating garbage, and then I pick up the trash can and I smash the guy on that. Oh, that's gonna be a disaster. No, no, nobody's gonna get hurt. I'm telling you, it's like you said, it's all fake. But it has nothing to do with the troops, Frank. A 60-year-old man eating trash? Who wants to see that? Um, no, but that's what people want. Hey, I got something for you. I got a character for you. You can be the ref. I'm not gonna be the ref. I'm a villain, don't you see? Look, I got garbage and I got... Frank! Just nasty, dude. Are you choking? Oh, my God. No, throw it up in the bathroom! Get out of here! Go take a break. Go take a break. The troops are going to be very happy to see that. All right, let's Look get this. this. Mess, let's, let's, get, let's get back to it. Oh, yeah! Oh, you got me. The trash man! You got me with the damn... Oh, shit, I get you cricket. Uh, uh, Must have had an edge. Uh, oh. Uh, <laughs> yeah. uh, 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 no. Oh, God. No. Me, me, Frank, me, the coolest guy in the history of this goddamn school. Oh, they're all gonna pay. They're all gonna pay the ultimate prize. Whoa! Oh. Dude, what's all that stuff you're grabbing? Tools! Tools! Duct tape, zip ties, and gloves! I have to have my tools! 
Well, why do you have a bunch of, like, weird tools in a hidden compartment in your car? Fetish, fetish shit! I, 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 I like to bind, I like to be bound! I got... Uh, that's not important! Don't ask me questions! I'm not taking questions! The Golden God is not taking questions! I am the Golden God! I, I'm taking action! I gotta go! Whoa, 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 Wait a second, Dennis. Wait a second. Oh. I think we can help you, dude. Yeah? Yeah, we can help each other. We both want the same thing. Revenge. You're gonna be our new Psycho Pete, pal. And guess what? The freight train's back in service! Let's what? get nuts in that school. Let's all go right, crazy, alright? Come on, let's get some revenge here. Train's coming. Oh, Watch out for that train! Oh, Watch out for that train! Oh, that train's coming! Oh, oh, all right! Oh, right. Oh, hey, let's get crazy! Let's get crazy! Let's get nuts! Let's get nuts! Let's get nuts. Please don't touch me. You're gonna hurt each other. Huh? No, <laughs> we're good, man. <gasps> we're just having no, fun. Okay, I just, oh, you bite that dude. Yeah, it was uh, a bite. It, it was, was a, a bite. Yeah, yeah you knew I could bite him a little bit. No, man, come here, come hey, here and wrestle hey, with us, dude. Yeah, you guys are wasted, man. Let's wrestle. Yeah, you wasted. No, we're not. Hey, you're not wasted? No, no, we're completely sober. But you guys drank a lot, though. Yeah. You guys yeah. drank more than anybody I've ever seen. Oh, oh really, dude? Woo! Woo! Oh. <laughs> it works out. Yeah. Yeah. Ready? Five, six, seven, eight. Nightman, sneaky and mean. Spider inside my dreams, I think I love you. You make me wanna cry, you make me wanna tell you. I love you, 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 Nightman. Every night you come into my room and pin me down. You with your strong arms and pin me down. And I try to fight you, you come inside me. Whoa, 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 I mean, the first half of that song was kind of cool, but what's with the second half? It's about the Nightman, like, you know, like, filling me up and I become him. I become the spirit of the Nightman. But it sounds like a song where a man breaks All into right. your house and rapes you. What, dude? Where are you getting that from? All right, no, here. It's just two men sharing the night. It might seem wrong, but it's just right. It's just two men sharing each other. It's just two men like loving brothers. One on top and one on bottom. One inside and one is out. One is screaming, he's so happy. The other screaming, a passionate shout, it's the nightman. The feeling's so wrong and right. Daylight. What? Yeah, I like that. Day, day man. Day man. Fighter of the night man. Champion of the sun. Sun. You're a master of karate and friendship <laughs> for everyone. A day man. That's it. Day man. Oh. Fighter of the night man. Oh. Champion of, of the sun. sun. <laughs> oh. You're a master of karate and friendship for everyone. Dayman! Dayman! Oh. Nice, we'll get the... Fighter of the night, man! Oh. Champion! Prepare to experience sexual magic. Dayman! Oh! Do I to you if I was that boy that's inside of you. Tiny boy, ah. little boy, Ooh. baby boy, I need you. Ah. Tiny boy, Ooh. little boy, oh. want to make love to you. 
If you only knew what I'd do to you If I was that boy that's inside of you Inside, inside, inside of you, my boy Is he sleeping? Yes, he's sleeping right over there Just the way you like him Did you bring the toll? Confound your lousy toll, troll. God damn it. Stop laughing at me. You gotta pay the troll toll. If you wanna get into that boy's hole, you gotta pay the troll toll to get in. You want the baby boy's hole, you gotta pay the troll toll. You gotta pay the troll toll to get in. Troll toll. Not responding to the pageantry well, at all. The whole second verse is completely ridiculous. The second verse is necessary to clarify what we are. Oh, We're mics. We're mics. We're not. Our microphones are on. Are they hearing this? Do this routine. Go. go. Ah! 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 Community! Community! Woo! Ah! 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 Sometimes it's in. Sometimes it's out. Are those mirrors? No. You creep. Look out, faggot! Holy oh, shit. shit! God! <coughs> Are you okay? Oh. Hey, Frank, what the hell was that? What? I saved your life. But you called me the F word. So what? I'm a hero. You used the slur, dude. That's like a hate crime. Yeah, that's hateful you speech, really man. Yeah, he saved his life. You really yeah, can't, you can't say, say that, that word anymore. So which is it? Look out, faggot! Mac, new to look. Dennis and D, new to look. Charlie, who kicked him in the chest, new to look. There's a spider. Deep in my soul, soul. He's lived here for years, years. He just won't let go. He's laying around. He's got a mean bite. Now he's ready to fight. And stand up for what he knows. Run out and hook in. Run out and hook in. Show these people how to play football. I'm gonna make Mac look so bad. My form is perfect. I'm like Jerry Rice. Feel that stride. So fluid and fast. I've got the stride of a gazelle. A beautiful, beautiful gazelle person. My body is achieving a perfect symmetry right now. It's that long, lean muscle I've worked so hard to achieve. I should have popped my shirt off.
God damn it. I really should have popped that shirt off. I wonder if any women are watching from the sidelines. Toxic spill? Yeah. What's that? Disregard that, Frank. It's a bunch of liberal bullshit. Right. Right. This is a nice spot. Yeah, yeah. Oh! What's that? You were supposed to get booze. Oh! This is ham. Soaked in rum. It is loaded with booze. God damn it, Frank. Eating your drinks? Frank. Frank. We are no longer in relaxing mode. We are now in survival mode. Will you stop being so dramatic? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Where's the rum ham? What? Where's the rum? Ah! Ah! Rum ham! No! Frank, stay in the boat! Frank, rum stay ham. in the boat! Oh, rum ham! I'm sorry, rum ham! I'm sorry! Rum ham! Oh. Oh, God. Stress? Okay? I've stumbled onto a major company conspiracy, Mac. How about that for stress? What the hell are you talking about? This company is being bled like a stuck pig, Mac, and I got a paper trail to prove it. Check this out. Take a look at this. Jesus oh, Christ, Charlie. That right there is the mail. Now let's talk about the mail. Can we talk about the mail, please, Mac? I've been dying to talk about the mail for you all day, okay? Pepe Sylvia, this name keeps coming up over and over again. Every day, Pepe's mail is getting sent back to me. Pepe Sylvia, Pepe Sylvia. I look in the mail, well, this whole box is Pepe Sylvia! So I say to myself, I gotta find this guy. I gotta go up to his office. I gotta put his mail in the guy's goddamn hands. Otherwise, he's never gonna get it. He's gonna keep coming back down here. So I go up to Pepe's office, and what do I find out, Mac? What do I find out? There is no Pepe Sylvia. The man does not exist, okay? So I decided, oh shit, buddy, I gotta dig a little deeper. There's no Pepe Sylvia, you gotta be kidding me! I got boxes full of Pepe! All right, so I start marching my way down to Carol and HR, and I knock on her door and I say, Carol! Carol, I gotta talk to you about Pepe! And when I open the door, what do I find? There's not a single goddamn desk in that office. There is no Carol in HR. Matt, half the employees in this building have been made up. This office is a goddamn ghost town. Okay, so the, 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 the what? The mattress? What do we need a mattress for? What do you mean, what do we need a mattress for? Why in the hell do you think we just spent all that money on a boat? The whole purpose of buying the boat in the first place was to get the ladies nice and tipsy topside so we can take them to a nice, comfortable place below deck and, you know, they can't refuse because of the implication. Oh, uh, okay. You had me go in there for the first part. The second half kind of threw me. Well, dude, dude, th think about it. She's out in the middle of nowhere with some dude she barely knows. You know, she looks around her. What does she see? Nothing but open ocean. Ah, uh, there's nowhere for me to run. What am I going to do? Say no? Okay. That, <laughs> <laughs> that seems really dark. Though. No, no, it's not dark. You're misunderstanding me, bro. I'm, I'm, I think I am. Yeah, you are. <laughs> because if the girl said no, then the answer obviously is no. No. But the thing right. is, is she's not going to say yeah. no. She would never say no because of the implication. Now, you, you've said that word, implication, a couple of times. What, what implication? The implication that things might go wrong for her if she refuses to sleep with me. Now, not that things are going to go wrong for her, but she's thinking that they will. But it sounds like she doesn't want to have Why sex with you. Why aren't you understanding this? I don't, she, she doesn't know whether she wants to have sex with me. It's that she doesn't know. That's not know. the issue. Are she, you going to hurt be a, I'm not going to hurt oh, these women. Okay. Why would I ever hurt these women? I, I feel like you're not getting this at all. I'm at not all. getting it. God damn. Well, don't you look at me like that. You certainly wouldn't be in any danger. So they are in danger. No one's in any danger. Trivia! Oh, I can do trivia, baby! Oh. <laughs> Dude, and you definitely wrote this one. Nice. Oh. Lay it on me! Lay it on me! Question. Dennis is asshole. Why Charlie hate? I don't think I wrote that. You definitely wrote this one, Charlie. Who else would have written this? I'm not remembering that. I don't oh think I wrote God. that one. Of course you did. How many other illiterates are in the... Just throw out a guess. Pass. No, don't pass. pass. No, no, pass. no. Don't pass. No, he didn't pay. He didn't pass. Hey, just pass. throw out a guess. Any guess. Come on. Pass. Son oh, of a bitch. I, I can't Charlie. think of one. All right, chance to steal. Oh, because Dennis is a bastard man. <laughs> That's what it is. <laughs> I definitely wrote enthusiast. Is your cat making too much noise all the time? Is your cat constantly stomping around, driving you crazy? Is your cat clawing at your furniture? Think there's no answer? You're so stupid. There is kitten mittens. Finally, there's an elegant, comfortable mitten for cats. I couldn't 
didn't hear anything. Is your cat one-legged? Is your cat fat, skinny, or an in-between? That doesn't matter, cause one size fits all. Kitten mittens, you'll be smitten. So come on down to Patty's Pub. We're the home of the original kitten mittens. Me ow. Uh, I'm not sure I understand what's happening. I'm schizophrenic. D, mm. I swear you would be of more use to me if I skinned you and turned your skin into a lampshade. Or fashioned you into a piece of high-end luggage. I can even add you to my collection. Are you saying that you have a collection of skin luggage? Of course I'm not, D. Don't be ridiculous. Think of the smell. You haven't thought of the smell, you bitch! Now you say another word and I swear to God I will dice you into a million little pieces and put those pieces in a box, a glass box, that I will display on my mantle. <laughs> One time the guys got hooked on crack. It was really crazy. Well, they found a baby in a dumpster. They wanted to make some money with the baby, but nobody would buy the baby because it was white. They sort of had to turn it brown. We were fighting over the sword, and just about when we were about to hit, each other with the sword, social services came in, we thought we were killing the baby. <laughs> I, I don't understand this talk. Charlie wrote this musical. Oh man, it was really funny. I play a troll on the musical. A troll? Yeah, and it's called The Night Man Cometh. I can sing you my song if you like. Uh, you, man. You, gotta, you gotta pay the troll toll to get into this boy's hole. Oh, yeah, yeah, I kept saying, yeah, I kept saying, you gotta pay to get in. I was saying, uh, soul, he was saying, I, he thought I was saying, boys whole. One of the things I like doing most is banging whores. I, uh, I go out and bang a lot of whores. Yeah. Oh, well, hello and Merry Christmas. So, where's your little one? Oh, ho, 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 ho. you're a big boy, aren't you? <laughs> Is he retarded? I got this one. So, son, what would you like for Christmas, huh? Did you fuck my mom? What? Did you fuck my mom? What do you mean? I, uh... Did you fuck my mom, Santa Claus? <laughs> Did you fuck my mom? No. Did you fuck her? No. Did you fuck my fucking mom? Did you fuck my mom, Santa? Yeah! Yeah! Ah, he's fighting my leg! Charlie! Get him on the ring! Kill him! Yeah! Look, here's the thing. Now Frank wants to start doing it too. So what? So what? Let him do it. Well, he wants me to do it with him. I assumed you two did that already. Me too. No. And now he wants us to do it with the Chinese guy across the street. So I knew you wouldn't be into that. Well, no, I'm not into that. That's bizarre. Exactly. I feel like I should be doing it with you guys. And <sighs> come on, man. This is getting weird and messy. I, I don't want to get come you involved. On, There's too many people. Just go no. do it with Frank. Okay, well, is Dean on it? Ew, God, I no. Would we, no. That's why she's at the factory, to distract her. Come on, guys, it should be you and me, okay? Look, I like cream pies as much as the next guy. Oh, sh sh don't say it out loud. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Let me make a cream pie for you, okay? Then you can try it. See what you think. I do not want to taste your cream pie. They taste great, I can guarantee it. Oh, you've tasted yours? Of course I have, haven't you? No! I've tasted mine, I didn't like it. I've tasted mine, yeah. I, I like mine. Whatever, dude. If you don't care about the taste, fine. All right, but they're not just gonna be for us anyway. It's not, what? We're gonna sell them to everyone in Philly. Who the hell's gonna wanna buy them? Everyone's gonna wanna buy them. Everyone loves them, especially little kids. <laughs> dude, little kids. I love watching a kid do it. Oh. And dude, you are gonna get in a lot of trouble. Hell no, dude. It's not like I'm gonna do it without the parents' permission. I'll do everything oh, No parent is gonna, gonna let you. Go. Parents are gonna watch. They're gonna be so psyched to see how happy the kid is. Oh, what are you talking about? You gotta go overseas for that. That's no. Just... Well, no, you don't. That's as American as it gets. Guys, you gotta think about this as a business venture. All right, the three of us combining our ingredients, making like one gigantic delicious cream pie. Some little kid's sucking it down and he's paying us for the pleasure. Hang on a second. Now, the first step to any erotic conquest is to D. Demonstrate your value. In this most recent case, my subject was Kaylee. 
a cute pharmacist. I demonstrated my value to her by filling a prescription. I told her, it's for my grandmother. She's quite ill. Thus demonstrating my value as a loving grandson and an all-around great guy. Ooh. Now, let's move on. Once you've demonstrated your value, you are going to want to ask her out. Once you've asked her out, you move on to E. Engage physically. I personally try to engage the girl physically without ever going on the date, which to me is really just a waste of time and money. I'll tell her I know this great little restaurant doesn't take reservations. That makes it sound cool, makes it sound exclusive. And then when we get to the restaurant, the restaurant is closed, as of course it always is on Sundays. So I'll feign surprise and say something along the lines of, well, I guess we could grab a pizza and watch a movie at my place. And once we're on my bed, it is game over. I engage her physically and the sexual waltz begins. Pizza's good. You're the one that's good. Right, which brings me to the first N, nurturing dependence. You're gonna wanna nurture that dependence that she's feeling on you now, guys. Have her car towed, or you can slash her tires. Either way, make her depend on you for rides. Or you can use my personal go-to, which is to create a fictional angry neighbor who's threatening her and tell her, you'll take care of her. Now, if you've completed all the other steps properly up to this point, she'll naturally want to take the relationship to the next level, but you're not going to do that. You're going to do the exact opposite. Pull back, guys, pull back. Which brings me to the second N, neglect emotionally. I mean, stop taking her phone calls. Cancel all your plans. Maybe that fictional angry neighbor that you've simulated comes back, and this time, you're not around to cool him off. And that's the perfect time to I. Inspire hope. In Kaylee's case, I went to her window and I screamed, Kaylee, listen, listen, wait. I want to tell you that the reason I was distant is because I was afraid that you were going to break my heart. And I got scared. But I'm not scared anymore, baby. I love you. I need you. And then, naturally, we bang. This is the best bang of all because it's very emotional for her. You see, she thinks she's broken through my tough exterior and coerced affection from a man who was afraid to love. And then I slink out into the night, never to talk to her again. That's right. I S. Separate entirely. D E N N I S. The dentist system. That, my friends, is the key to winning any girl's heart. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, whoa, what, what the hell are you doing here? I'm swooping in on your chick. What? No, dude, I'm trying to re this chick so I can shove it in Dee's face. What, I'm, what is this swooping in business? Oh, that's my system, the Mac. Move in after completion. I wait till you're done with them, and then I swoop in, give them a shoulder to cry on, and then we hump. Oh, you've been humping these girls after I'm done with them? Oh, yeah, dude. I come in as the sensitive intellectual type. Why do you think I'm always reading books and shit when we do the spider routine? I thought you were just my wingman, though. No, no, I'm swimming in your wake. What are you two dickheads doing here? What are you doing here? What do you mean? I'm here for the scraps. Frank, I haven't had a chance to get in there yet, okay? So just... What do you mean? What's taking you so long? Wait, 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 wait. What, you have a system where you come in after Mac? That's right, I come in after Mac, but he's taking, like, forever this time. I got my Magnum condoms, I got my Watt of hundreds, I'm ready to plow. You should see him feast. He's like a mantis. It's amazing. Oh, that's good. Call me that from now on. Mantis. No, nobody's calling you man. Look, you guys got to back off, oh. okay? I'm trying to re Dennis this chick. No, no you back no. off. Wait, 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 wait a second, Frank. He's right. It's a delicate ecosystem. We got to we gotta stick with it. Just let him do his thing, and then we'll come in for back seconds off. and scraps. Get out. Just play it cool. Well, she sees you. Hurry up, though, because... Magnum condoms and a lot of hundreds. Oops, oh! I dropped... My monster condom that I use for my magnum dong. I'm out of here. Oh, okay, all right, but, but play it subtle, all right? Subtle? Yeah. Frank, play it subtle. Subtle. Hello! Hello? Ongo Goblogian, the art collector. Charmed, I'm sure. Yes. <laughs> I'm going to invite you to a show. Okay. But first, Allow me to destroy your gallery. Oh. Bullshit. Bullshit. Derivative. That 
I love. I absolutely love. Um, that's just the air conditioner. I want it. It's everything. I mean, look at us. We're just air conditioners. I mean, after all, we're、yeah. just walking around on the planet, breathing, conditioning the air.、Right. I condition it hot. That conditions it cold. I mean, it's symbiotic. No. No, it I mean, is. Just... Okay. So, yes, the videotape is done. My teeth are scattered throughout the car, and the will is in place. Okay. Great. Toss it out the window. They'll think we did it at the last minute. Okay. Got it. Yeah. Okay, what's next? All right, I'm gonna gun this car as fast as it goes directly into that wall.、Mm-hmm. Now, judging by the distance, I'm thinking I could get her up to about 60, 70 miles an hour. Oh, definitely, definitely. At the last possible second, I'm thinking maybe three feet from the wall.、Okay. We jump out to safety. The car explodes in a hot ball of fury, and we're dead to the world. Okay, Doki. Good luck with that. Wait, where are you going, dude? Well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna watch you do it. No, we need to do it together. Know, That's not really doing anything. No, just... Yes, you are, Charlie. You're here for moral know, support. If, if no one's actually seeing us jump out of the car, well, whatever, we're going to kill ourselves. I'm going to watch you. Look, man, you can do it. I'm going to do it myself. The whole thing's going to be better without me anyway. I'm going to tell you, it's going to be great without me. All right, buddy. Good luck. Pussy. Frank's little beauties. I want to thank you all for participating. I know some of you may have heard about that other guy. I am not going to diddle your kids. I'm not like that. That's not my thing. I met that guy in a titty bar. That's enough. That's like a. That's enough. Hi there. This is bad. We got to definitely write a song about how we we do not diddle kids. Do not diddle kids. It's no good diddling kids. There is no quicker way for people to think that you are diddling kids than by writing a song about it. You gotta write a song that says, "Ooh, I wouldn't do it with anybody younger than my daughter. No little kids gotta be big, older than my wife, younger than my daughter, something like that." Don't write a song about that. No, I'm clapping. Yankee Doodle went to town riding on a pony. Stuck another in his hat and called it Tear down this wall. The only thing we have to fear is fear itself. Hey, hey, what is this? What are you people doing to my son? Go back to your seat. All right, who's in charge here? Sir, I'll go back to your seat. Someone should have worn a shirt, right? Probably the kid. The kid definitely. It、yeah. felt uncomfortable. But at a rave, I, I feel like that would have been awesome. I know, but the kids make it weird. Do it. Any last words? Yeah, last words. Last words. Yeah, 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 yeah. I got some last words. Come closer. Go suck an egg. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm gonna suck an egg. Suck an egg. I'm gonna suck an egg. Parts of you halfway through and letting you play Murtaugh 
in blackface. I feel like it was in very poor taste in retrospect. I think it was in poor taste that you were doing Murtaugh in whiteface. I mean, for God's sakes, Dennis, what message does that send? A lot of great actors have done blackface. Oh, yeah, oh you know, there's countless examples of, of very classy actors doing, doing blackface. Let's see, we've got the great C. Thomas Howell in, in, in Soul Man. Uh, we've got the Wayans Brothers in, in White Chicks. That was a very tasteful example of reverse blackface. Okay, those are bad examples, okay? There's tons of good examples of old movies with... Okay. Frank, help me out. Look, Lawrence you... Olivier in Othello. Lawrence Olivier Perfect. in Othello, dude. That's like the classiest actor Perfect. of all time. Yeah, but I guarantee you there were some black people that were working on that movie that were like, hey, man, what that white man doing? Come on, that ain't right. Get a black man. Okay, what, so hold what on. What kind of voice You're is doing that? a black voice and that's not racist? That, I'm just saying that's how black people talk. That's not racist. So you would do a black guy with a black voice, but not a black guy with a black face? I don't have a problem at all with doing a black voice. So you don't have a black voice. That. That's just a, that's an so accurate I don't understand that, dude. I'm just saying it's just about doing it tastefully, okay? Mm. Yeah, and you gotta make the lips funny. Oh, yeah. no, 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 no. What? You have to be funny. The lips It's not have about to be funny. Outlined. It's, it's not about wasn't. being funny at all, okay? It's about to. Oh, my God. I'm getting pissed off. You can't do the voice. I'm right. Righteous. I'm not going to stand here, present some egghead scientific argument based on fact. I'm just a regular dude. I like to drink beer, you know? I love my family. Rock, flag, and eagle, right, Charlie? He's got a point. No, he doesn't. What? See, Charlie? These liberals are trying to assassinate my character. You know, I can't change their mind. I won't change my mind, because I don't have to. Because I'm an American. And then... <sighs> Best of all, Sir Isaac Newton gets born and blows everybody's nips off with his big brains. Of course, he also thought he could turn metal into gold and died eating mercury, making him yet another stupid bitch. Are you seeing a pattern? No. <laughs> Mr. Reynolds, these were all the smartest scientists on the planet. Only problem is they kept being wrong sometimes. This is insane, you fool! The barrel's out of the van before we got in? They're really heavy, Dee. We've already had to do it like a million times. Where'd you get the money for this gap? Dee, will you shut up and let me continue? Now, Frank, when we get back to the bar, you waterboard the shit out of Bruce and get a confession. No problem. Now, Dennis, you take that confession to the police, use your charm and good looks, and get that reward money. Done and done. Okay, Dee, you continue to be useless. Charlie and I will use that reward money to pay off our electricity bill. Then we'll probably buy some more gasoline, because I feel like that's a great plan. Yeah, no, I'm saying, no, the brakes. Guys, why aren't the, the brakes working? Because I cut the brakes! Wild car, bitches! Yeah! What? Oh, 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 my God! 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 This is the best part coming up. Go. So spread the word to all of your friends. At Patty's Pub, you're guaranteed to catch a... Virus. Just ask this guy. I got infected. Get it away from me. Or her. No, I'm busy. She looks like she caught the... Bug! So spread this video to all your friends, because it's a computer virus. Virus. Take it from me. I am a doctor. Doctor Toboggan. Mantis Toboggan. What? You sent that to all of our Facebook friends? Yeah. They're gonna think they have a computer virus, Frank. Wait, were you the ones who said we needed the virus video? I said a viral video, Frank, goddammit. Oh my God. No, I wanna talk to you guys a little bit about dancing. Now, back in the 50s and the 60s and the 70s, people used to dance all the time. That's the way we solved our problems. That's how they solved their problems, yeah. through dance. Then all of a sudden, we stopped dancing. You know, grunge came in. We dressed in, in plaid and, and oversized jeans. Then later on, kids wore trench coats and shot each other in school, and that's not cool. But guess what? Guess what's going on in the high school now? Kids are dancing again. Organized choreographed dance. They're doing organized choreographed dances to solve their problems. They also give each other blowjobs. They got these things called rainbow parties. Right, wrap it up, wrap it up, wrap it up, no, let's but go. They have these rain yeah, but that's hey. not the point of the- Come The on. point is we're gonna show you a dance. Let's get started, let's go. Lights.
the sun. Ah, you're a master of karate and friendship for everyone. Dayman, oh, fighter of the night, man. Oh, champion of the sun. Sun, sun, sun. Stage freeze, just do it. And I don't know why this is happening, but I actually feel a lot better. Well, you look better. You guys all look better. I'm actually feeling better, too. I feel great. Yeah. How is that even possible? All we've been doing is sitting here and drinking. How could we have gotten better so quickly? Oh, my God, you guys. You guys, we haven't been drinking since we quarantined ourselves into the bar, at least since we got stuck in the bathroom. Oh, well, that's right. Wait, wait, wait. So what are you saying? That we've never had the flu? We were just having alcohol withdrawal? Yeah. Alcohol withdrawals? That's great! Is it great? It means we're all alcoholics. Uh, yeah, yeah. Right. Well, what do we do with that information? What do you do with any information? You just stuff it deep down inside and keep an eye you on it. You keep it. I'm oh. certainly not going to stop drinking. I, I mean, I physically can't. No, no, I, yeah. I'm not at this point. I'm a young guy. 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 I'